Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you through my Sunday self-care routine. This is my little routine that I like to do about once a week. It is a bit more extensive, it does take a little bit more time, but it makes me feel so, so good. And it's just an amazing way to rejuvenate and to prepare yourself for the week ahead. Plus, I just think it's so important to take some time to really take care of yourself, both physically and mentally. And I'm really excited and very proud to say that this video is in collaboration with Cult Beauty. I buy almost like 95 percent of my skincare from cold beauty and i've been shopping there for the last two to three years so when they asked me if i wanted to do a video with them i said a huge yes and august is actually cold beauty's skincare month and they want to help you build your perfect routine through their school of skincare something i love about cold beauty is that they're focused around education around skincare and they have super helpful beauty advisors that are on hand to help you from working out how to vary your am and PM routines to identifying the right product texture for your specific skin concern and you can contact them via beauty advice at coldbeauty.co.uk they helped me with my routine and I'm so excited to share what I've been using because my skin has been looking so good I feel so confident and comfortable in my skin I'm not even wearing foundation these days so I'm very pleased and excited to share what's been really working for me what's really interesting is that a lot of the products that work really Really, really well for me are actually more indie brands for example indie lee or disciple or skin iceland and that's something else that i love about cold beauty is that they have such a good selection of more independent smaller brands that have incredible formulas and that work in more small batches and they're created by people who are true skin enthusiasts and it's not always from these big brands which they do have some bigger brands on there as well but i love that you can find this really curated and high performance selection of some really really great skincare and i am a total skincare lover so i find it really exciting to shop on there plus i love that every single product that's on cold beauty is really loved and adored by lots of people hence the name cold beauty they only stock products that have a really good reputation and that a lot of people love so it takes a lot of the guesswork out of buying skincare and they also have makeup items as well plus a huge benefit if you live in Europe or anywhere outside of the US where you find it difficult to get skincare or makeup products they ship worldwide and a lot of the time for free if you spend I think it's over 40 pounds so it's an incredible source for people who live outside of the US although they do also ship to the US but if you're living in Europe or anywhere else and you want to get your hands on some of these things you can in case some of you guys are not familiar with my skin type I have very sensitive acne prone skin I've been through some pretty difficult times with my skin and I really have to manage myself both internally and also externally so using the right product so all of these are really great for sensitive skin for acne prone skin and I would say that my skin is a bit more combination so my t-zone tends to get a little bit shiny and oily throughout the day and then here around my cheek and my mouth area I am a little bit drier so if you have skin kind of like me that's a little bit oily a little bit dry acne prone sensitive then hopefully these products will work really great for you as well and if you do like anything I do have a discount code that you guys could use and the code is C CBX Annie and that will get you 15% off when you spend 20 pounds or more there are some exclusions though but I will leave those down below in the description box but everything that you're gonna see me talking about today it is eligible for the 15% so yes let's get started the first thing that I like to do is just set the mood I think this is really important I love to create a little ambiance around me with some scented candles I put on some really chill music and sometimes I even like to listen to to an audiobook or a YouTube video. Nothing that I have to watch, but just something that's kind of playing in the background that's really uplifting. I just try to create a really good space with lots of positivity. And then I start my skincare routine. And I will use a lot of the products from my normal routine, which I'm gonna share with you guys. And then there are a few little special products that I save for Sundays and for my pamper routine. So they're like little treats. So I'm gonna share those with you guys as well. But the first thing that I like to do is cleanse my 
skin and this is one of my favorite cleansers by Kate Somerville it is the eradicate daily foaming cleanser I've been using this for about a year now and I have talked about it in a few of my other skincare videos but it's super good if you have acne prone oily skin because it contains sulfur and sulfur is an incredible and very natural ingredient to help with breakouts and the consistency is incredible it's very creamy and kind of like whipped and it never dries my skin out even though it's for acne prone skin but I feel like it really cleans deep within the pore and that's why I keep repurchasing this I think this is the third or fourth bottle that I've gone through and it is incredible. So once I've cleansed my skin, I like to do a little bit of exfoliation and this is another favorite. It is from Omor Ovixa. It's a Hungarian skincare line. This is a dual exfoliant. So it has both physical and chemical exfoliation properties. It contains Hungarian more mud, green microalgae, which gives it that beautiful blue green color. It's also got copper in it, which is great for the skin and some fruit extracts which help to kind of chemically exfoliate the top layer of your skin plus it just smells so so good and so uplifting and refreshing and I love skincare products that also give you a therapeutic benefit and exfoliation is super important because you want to make sure that you're removing the top layer of dead skin cells especially if you have oily or acne prone skin or even dry skin I would say exfoliation is one of the key things in making your skin really glowy and healthy looking. It's super anti-aging as well, so it helps prevent fine lines and little wrinkles from forming because you're constantly rejuvenating the skin. So it always looks youthful and fresh and like supple and bouncy. I think a lot of that has to do with good exfoliation. So this is my favorite. It is a little bit pricey, but I think the ingredients are so amazing. So I think it's worth it. And you can use the code if you want to save some money as well. So highly highly recommended then i move on to one of my favorite parts which is face masks and treatments and this is something that i love to do on sundays specifically because i like to do a few different things it is a little bit extra but i love it if you tend to suffer with any darkness underneath your eyes or if you have like puffy eyes or you went out the night before and didn't sleep much or you you've had a bit too much salt these little under eye patches are amazing these are from skin iceland they're called the hydro cool firming eye gels. I like to keep mine in the fridge to keep them nice and cool and when you put them on underneath your eyes it's like a like a facelift for your under eyes. They're really great for depuffing the under eyes especially when they're a little bit colder and also now in the summer it's just the most refreshing thing ever and they don't feel heavy or irritating underneath the eyes as well which I find is a problem with a lot of under eye gels is that they're a little bit too heavy. These are really lightweight and you you can wear them for a long time and the gel underneath these eye patches contain mineral rich glacier water from Iceland which I think is so cool it also contains pure encapsulated oxygen so it's really great for stimulating the blood flow and just really waking up this under eye area so I put these on and then I go in with a face mask and the one that I've been loving lately is from Indie Lee if you guys haven't heard of Indie Lee they are an incredible more natural and clean clean skincare line and their products are super super effective i do have a few others that i really like their face wash is also really good and i have a toner here that's amazing as well which i'm going to share with you guys but this is called the clearing mask and this helps to purify detoxify and nourish the ingredients in this face mask are like the perfect little cocktail for acne prone skin but without being over drying it's got bentonite clay zinc oxide sulfur which you guys know is amazing but it's also got a really good blend of some exfoliating acids so it's got glycolic acid salicylic acid and hyaluronic acid which will give you a nice dose of moisture so it's incredibly detoxifying and fast acting but it's not at all drying so this is not going to dry completely on your skin and that's something that I find difficult with a lot of acne treatments is that they can just be very stripping and like suck the life out of your face but this does not do that. They really managed to find a good balance between detoxing the skin but also nourishing it. So 
I am a huge, huge fan of this face mask and I don't like to play around when it comes to face masks or facial treatments. I like products that get things done and that are effective because as you guys know, my skin is very acne prone. So I need to use products that really work and that are really effective. Otherwise, I just waste my money and my skin stays not looking good. So it's a lot of trial and error, but products like this and the ones that I've shared with you guys are amazing. So at this point, my skin is super clean and detoxified and fresh feeling. And the next thing that I like to do is a little facial massage and I really like to use this tool this is called a gua sha I always feel so silly saying that because I don't really know how to pronounce it but it's this little tool that is made out of jade which is a crystal and this is actually an ancient beauty tool that was used for thousands of years in Asian cultures it's still practiced a lot today but now the Western world has gotten use of this little tool and it is amazing before doing this I like to just have a little bit of a slip to my skin to so something that this tool can just glide nicely over and I like to use a facial oil this has been my holy grail facial oil for the last few months it is from disciple it is called good skin I love that name and this oil is specifically designed for acne prone skin types there is an oil that we can use and this one has an amazing blend of cucumber seed oil turmeric rosemary geranium lavender tea tree and burdock root it's a really great mix of oils for more acne prone sensitive skin so I like to apply a little bit of this all over my face and then I will go in with my gua sha I always start from my forehead and I work my way down because it is very detoxifying and the theory is that you want to push all of the toxins and all of the excess fluid down your face and then into your neck so that it can be absorbed and detoxified by your system. So I do these very gentle upward motions about three times per area and I kind of move across my forehead. Then I do a little bit underneath my eyes. I like that it's just so simple but very effective. Plus it just feels amazing to give yourself a little facial massage and a little bit of extra love. It's also great for reducing any puffiness in the face. It's an amazing anti aging tool. So once I'm done with my little facial massage, I go on to a bit of toner and this is something new that I discovered and it is so incredible. This is again from Indie Lee. It is the Lotion Co-Q10 Toner and I use this more as an essence because it is so good. I don't want to waste any of it with a cotton pad. So I just pour in a few drops into the palm of my hand, rub my hands together and then pat it onto my skin. And the formula again is incredible. So it's alcohol free it's got hyaluronic acid which will give you a nice dose of moisture it's got aloe vera and chamomile extract and cucumber extract so it's like a nourishing drink for your skin cells and it's super lightweight it absorbs right into your skin and I just cannot get enough so once I'm done with that I go on to a little bit of serum this is the full-on Sunday routine the spa like experience so I just want to immerse my skin cells with as much goodness and nourishing nourishment and good vitamins as possible and serums are a great way to do that because they are very concentrated. I like to go for vitamin C based serums because they are super brightening for the skin and they're also quite rejuvenating and exfoliating. So if you suffer with pigmentation or acne scars or you just want to like brighten your overall skin tone, vitamin C serums are amazing. This is a new one that I've been using. It is from Dr. Dennis Gross. It is called the Clinical Concentrate Radiance Booster. And the vitamin C in here is time released, so it's gonna be working throughout the entire day or throughout the entire night. Vitamin C is an ingredient that I think everyone should be using in their skincare, whether you're younger or older, to improve the look of skin, whether you're suffering with breakouts or you're concerned about sun damage or you have fine lines and wrinkles vitamin C is one of those like powerhouse ingredients when it comes to skincare and this is a really nice formula it's very lightweight and it doesn't break my skin out which is of course <laughs> the number one thing when I'm trying skincare products is first does it break my skin out and this does not so I'm really happy about that plus it gives your skin a beautiful glow instantly when you put it on and lastly I like to apply a really hydrating moisturizer this is the summer Fridays jet lag mask but it's not a mask that you have to take off 
tops. It's just a very deeply moisturizing product that will really help to seal everything in. I'm baffled every time that I put this on that it can be so moisturizing, but doesn't leave any oiliness or greasiness to my skin. It almost has this like matte but radiant finish to the skin, so it's not at all oily. Plus the ingredients in this are really good as well. So it doesn't contain any parabens, sulfates, phthalates, mineral oil, silicones, synthetic dyes, or fragrances. So it's also a nice, more clean, natural product that also works really, really well. And I love that it's from a fellow influencer who created this, which I think is amazing. And that completes the skincare part of my Sunday self-care routine. I then like to move on to a little bit of body care as well. I like to start with a little bit of dry brushing. This is one of the dry brushes that I like to use. I do also have one that's a little bit stiffer, a little bit firmer and more intense. But if you're just getting into dry brushing, I would recommend this one. It's really good for the entire body. I start with my feet and I work my way up. So I go about three times over each section and always moving up towards my heart. Dry brushing is a great way to stimulate the blood flow just underneath the surface of the skin. So it can be really helpful in reducing some cellulite or uneven skin tone. And I feel like it helps to kind of keep the skin on the body toned as well because you are creating that constant stimulation and promoting lots of blood flow and oxygen to those areas and I love doing that just before I get into the shower because then I can kind of wash away all the dead skin cells and I love using a beautiful body wash something that just smells really relaxing and rejuvenating I'm huge on aromatherapy and de-stressing myself and calming myself with really good scents I love a good body lotion but for my little Sunday routine I kind of take it a step further and I apply a body serum so so this is like um, a facial serum for your body in the sense of the ingredients and the concentration of the ingredients. So this is the AHA Smart Renewal Body Serum from Ren Clean Skincare. Ren makes some really, really good, more natural skincare products. And this one has lactic acid to gently exfoliate. It's got probiotic extract to strengthen the skin's barrier and xylitol to help plump and smooth. This is amazing if you want to give yourself a nice glow and really hydrate your skin but also to naturally exfoliate your skin with those AHAs. So I apply that and then something else that I love is from Rock O'Neill. It is the Therapy Cherish Skin. Skin Repair Serum. It is aromatherapy heaven in a bottle. It's got a beautiful blend of some active essential oils and it's all natural. It is divine. It is pure love and pure goodness for your skin and it is a little bit more pricey so that's why I kind of tend to reserve it for more special occasions but I love to apply this on my chest, on my shoulders, on my arms because I like to breathe this in as well so if I put it here it's like very close to my nose so I can go around and smell this during the rest of the day. It's super therapeutic and I am so in love with this. I have some of her other uh, products as well, some of her other essential oils. It's like therapy for your skin, for your senses, and it's a beautiful uh, product for the body. I would highly, highly recommend this. I'll then get into some really comfy clothes and I will go and do something really relaxing for my mind. Some of the things that I like to do is meditate. I meditate every single morning, first thing when I wake up. It's a new habit that I got into earlier this summer. I talked about that in a few previous videos, but it's a really nice thing to also do in the evening time or before you go to bed. There are lots of great meditations online. Um, even if you just Google like end of the day meditation or relaxing meditation. And if I have a really busy week ahead, I like to take the time to sit down and properly plan out my week. I'll basically take about 15 to 20 minutes to really sit down and think about how I want that week to go. What can I do to make this week the most incredible week and the most productive week? I think keeping organized and planning out your week or your day just is such a good way to keep you focused and it's something that really helps me as well especially lately since you guys have probably noticed i'm uploading a lot more and i'm just doing a lot more it just helps to also calm my mind because sometimes i walk around and i'm thinking 
I need to do this, or, I want to make a video about that, or I need to call this person, or I need to send this person an email. So it's a nice way to kind of just get all of those thoughts onto paper. I like to do a lot of my organizing and planning on the computer, but I'll also take some time to write in my journal. Um, this is another new habit that I recently started to do, and it's been so incredible. Journaling is a great way to really get in touch with the essence of who you are, to really get to know yourself and to write down your fears, your challenges, and that will help you to figure out what you can do about it. It will give you ideas on how to overcome it, it's a great space to also practice gratitude to write down what you're grateful for and your goals and your dreams and for me my journal is a very very special place whenever I'm done writing in my journal I always feel really uplifted and inspired it really sets your mind up to be positive to look for the good in things I think it's so important to just fill yourself up with lots of goodness, lots of love, positivity, fill yourself up so much that it kind of overflows and you can't help but inspire other people and you have so much more love and positivity to give to those around you. So I think there's a lot of value in self-care, not just for yourself, but for your family, for your friends, for your coworkers, and essentially for all the dreams and goals that you want to accomplish. So that is my Sunday self-care routine. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed and also maybe gotten inspired or picked up on some tips or some ideas that you can incorporate into your own self-care routines. I will have links to all of the products that I mentioned down below in the description box along with the discount code. Again, that is CBXANNY and it will get you 15% off any of these products or whatever products on the site that you want. Again, there are a few um, exceptions, but I'll have that information below. Also, if you have skincare questions, I highly recommend to email one of the beauty advisors on Cold Beauty they can give you some recommendations for your specific skin type and their email is beautyadvice at coldbeauty.co.uk and I would love to hear from you guys I'd love to know what your skincare routine looks like I'm going to be sharing a little skincare template over on my Instagram and it would be really cool if you guys could screenshot that fill it out and then tag me and tag cold beauty and I can see what products you're loving because you guys have given me some great recommendations for skincare products over the years I love to know what's working for you guys as well and yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you're all having an amazing day and i will see you guys in my next one Mwah. bye guys